Captain Gareth Prince, good to meet you. Can you talk me through them? So this is a, a Mastiff, it's a heavily armoured troop transporter uh, with a large weapon system on the top to keep you guys safe when they're out on the ground. Uh, this is one of our newer vehicles, it's a Husky, uh, it's a command variant so it takes out the leaders out on the ground uh, so they can protect it while they're making their decisions. And this here is a, a Jackal 2, uh, commanded by uh, Corporal White, who'll take you around the vehicle as we speak. Great, hi. Hello there, if you'd like to join me I'll take you around the vehicle. Great. Basically with this vehicle, some of it's, it's it's designed to be really fast and really manoeuvrable and that's the main the main thing that gets it out of trouble is its speed and manoeuvrability. But if it does get shot at, because they, obviously they do sometimes get shot at, it does have ballistic protection around the sides which will take small arms fire. And it's used for? It's used for reconnaissance basically, that's what it's used for. It, it, it will go around, the guys can get eyes on to, eyes onto the enemy positions and do overwatch and things like that and it can move, move out of the area quickly if there needs be. Tell me about what, what, the, what it has up here. Basically up here you've got, you've got a, weapons mount, a main weapons mount up on the top and you can have a heavy machine gun or a grenade machine gun up, up on there as a, as a heavy weapon system basically. And then in the front of it you've got um, a general purpose machine gun mount that the commander can utilise as well over a limited area. These are, these are the crew seats here. You've got two guys in the back and two in the front. So obviously you can have one sat down and one could be up top operating the machine gun itself and they can, they can, they can turn, around, turn uh, change around and stuff. You really like this vehicle, don't you? I love this vehicle. I think it's excellent. For what it's purpose for, it's highly effective. If I could go to war in any wheeled vehicle, I would personally choose this one. If you look under here then, basically, another cool thing about this vehicle is you can see the way the hull shaped, it's not quite flat to the ground. And what happens is, if there's an explosion underneath the vehicle, the shape of the hull helps to dissipate the blast. It's more likely to go through if it's flat. Do you see what I mean? Yeah, great stuff. Um, thanks for showing me uh, the features. Can we have a ride now? Yeah, no problem. This being one of the fastest armoured vehicles around, Chalk here tells me grown men have cried here. They've screamed and there have been a few trembles. But for these guys, it's all in a day's work.